Maggie wants to know why birds evolved beaks rather than adapting their teeth to crack nuts open the way that squirrels did. And I totally understand why you've asked this question this way. Lots of bird lineages do use their beaks to crack nuts. But as far as I know, there's no mainstream hypothesis that says that this is why birds evolved beaks in the first place. So why did birds evolve beaks? For a while, people thought it had to do with the evolution of flight. Replacing the teeth with a more lightweight chewing structure reduces the overall weight of the animal, which is good for flying. The problem with that is that toothless beaks, or beaks with reduced dentition, have evolved a whole bunch of times in animals that don't fly. For example, Triceratops, Oviraptor, and birds represent three separate evolutions of beaks within the Dinosauria. So yes, they're all dinosaurs, yes, they are all beaked, but each one of those lineage descends from immediate ancestors which had normal toothy jaws, and then there's turtles which have beaks and aren't dinosaurs at all. So clearly beaks are doing something other than helping animals fly. So what else have we got? Well, it turns out the evolution of beaks usually correlates with evolution away from obligate carnivory into herbivory or omnivory. And one thing about eating plants for a living is that it often requires being able to selectively crop from your food source, perhaps by plucking ground cover plants from among stones, or perhaps cropping edible leaves away from inedible wood. Either way, eating like that favors biting into your food with just the front of your mouth. But repeatedly doing that without a beak is kind of bad for the skull. It puts a lot of weird stresses on the bone, which damages it over time. Whereas, if you have a beak and you're biting with just the front of your mouth, that redistributes those stresses and stabilizes the skull, allowing the animal to eat that way continually throughout its life without injuring itself. So probably most of the times that beaks have evolved, it was actually as a pinching device for enhancing dexterity while eating, which means, functionally, birds' beaks actually have less in common with a squirrel's teeth and more in common with a human thumb and forefinger.